Ever since the debut of Barbie in 1959, the iconic doll has been able to do anything she sets her mind to. It's still all about being pretty. But some are saying Barbie might need to be a bit more politically correct. One of Mattel's doll collections, Dolls of the World, features a new Mexico Barbie that's sparking controversy. I'll just have to see how this goes over. As usual, this doll comes with accessories, a chihuahua, and a passport. But it's these items that seem to have people on edge. It seems a little prejudicial. On Twitter, comments are flying against Mattel, and it appears Mattel is tweeting back, standing by the doll, saying... Mexico Barbie is one of 100 Barbie dolls of the world. All wear an ensemble inspired by each country with a passport and animal. Which is true, Chili Barbie also has a dog. Holland Barbie comes with a rabbit. And China Barbie, well, she comes with a panda. From what I can see right now, all of this hullabaloo is coming from a bunch of grown-ups. But these are toys. They're meant for kids. So what kind of impact could it have on children? I think that kids in general will start to make up stories about their about whatever it is that they play with. At Hub City Books, they encourage imagination and creativity through both reading and writing. But manager Aaron Hare says any of the dolls of the world Barbies could stifle a kid's perception of the world. When I think about people I know that are from Mexico, friends that I have that are from Mexico, they don't carry around their chihuahuas and they don't um, wear traditional garb every day. She says it would be better for kids to learn about culture by meeting people, not by playing with a doll. Go out and have real experiences with real people. Ned says for him, these Barbies reflect on a bigger issue. They're pushing the pretty. For Scene on 7. And that that values women more than anything else they do. I'm Kate Valentine.